Yo, what's up, boys? Every subscriber I get in the year 2022, I will be donating 10 cents to a charity I have not decided yet, and we will pick as a whole collective uh, group of people. So if you're not subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe because it's basically a donation to charity in the entire year of 2022. All right, onto the video. Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam? Let's go to work. Today we're here doing our Try Our Thursday. Going to be a lot of fun. Going to be hopefully full of wins and not losses because that wouldn't be very try hard would it uh apologize i apologize for tears in my eyes i yawned right before this started <laughs> i just yawned right before this started and also uh for a little bit of low energy this video more than likely i did have a cup of coffee but i'm gonna need to make another because i'm still tired I didn't get too much sleep last night. Appa got, I, I think Appa's sick, maybe. Um, he was coughing a lot last night. And An enemy has he was like, he was coughing and then he would throw up after he coughed and it was just constant from like 5 a.m. It was just over and over and over and over and over and over. And, um... I didn't, yeah, I didn't go back to sleep. I was worried about him, honestly. And then he went outside and went to the bathroom and then came back in and he was fucking good as new. I should have just sent him outside at 5 a.m. Oh my gosh. I don't know. Maybe he like, maybe he just needed to eat some grass. <laughs> I don't know. Also, I haven't, um, I haven't showered yet. It is early morning, as you can see. Behind me, um, I haven't showered yet, so you know I don't look the very best. A little bit, sh I got a little bit of a shiny forehead right now, if you know what I mean. <laughs> but it's okay, you know. There, there's things, there's things that when you gotta get a video, you gotta get a video. You can't just not do it. You can't just not do. Like, come on. I have a job that people wish they could have. I can't just not do it. Like, what the heck? But yeah, so, but I, I, you know, with that being said, I am making excuses. <laughs> as long, as long as I say that, I am making excuses and I want you all to know that. I am tired. The energy might be a little bit low. <clears throat> However, let's try hard Thursday. So losses are not in the books for the day. I refuse to lose. Putting a Vulcan. Started meditation and going into a book of thought first item. Not necessarily, you know, new, I guess. Not like a new thing, but <clears throat> skipping your starter item is weird. Even if just for a little while. Alright, let's get your beads. Okay. He has meditation, not beads. Did alt the wave, so he got the XP. But nah, he I don't know. Went a little bit greed mode. Like for not having beads. For not having beads, like pushing up that hard was not the best play. I'm okay with this. I mean, he has no alt. If he decides to try to punch me in the head too hard, he can always med. Mm, I guess there's no real reason for me to stay here. Other than I want to get uh, my Ring of Hecate on my first back. Ouch. Oh, he can get his Book of Thoth. I was wondering, like, wait, why is he backing before I've backed? There's no way he can afford his Ring of Hecate. And then in my that's what happened in my mind. And then, don't worry. I caught back up to, you know, reality. Realized, or not even realized, but remembered that he was going Book of Thoth. <clears throat> All right. So, what's my game plan here? Basically, just out-pressure him. Vulcan has great clear. But, um... 
not the best fighting potential against an auto attack mage. Like, he uses his cooldowns and then he just kind of dies. As you can see there. He hit me with his ult. And, well, I mean, I say he hit me with his ult. I kind of let him. Like, I walked directly into it. But, um... But yeah, I mean, he's he's kind of SOL for now. Oh, okay. I'm actually really surprised that landed. I, I thought that he would be able to outrun that. It must have just gotten, like, just on the cusp of running out. Tickle his butt hair or something, you know? <laughs> See, that's the only way. Tickling his butt hair. That's the only way I get that kill. I'm, I am going to do your blue. I hope you don't mind. Hello, best friend, and also enemy. Okay. Super kill. Super kill, super blue. Appreciate, appreciate. Um, I'm just going to slowly auto these down. I'm not going to use my mana because I don't have a lot of it. And I want to do my blue still. Plus, I have mannequins for these, so... I probably should have been able... I should have just used a, a, a ability on the wave because I forgot that my mannequins gives me mana back. He altered the wave. My guy loves altered waves. I mean, you can't hate it. He's backing. I am also backing. What item should I go? I could, like, I should go Shoguns or Talisman here. And it is Try Hard Thursday, which means I shouldn't. <laughs> which means I shouldn't troll and I should just go, like, yeah, I mean, straight up, just as Try Hard as possible. And the best build here is either Shoguns or Talisman of Energy. Just because um, it gives you attack speed. It's magical defense that gives attack speed. This is 30% attack speed with 150 health. And talisman is 300 health and more protection, but slightly less attack speed. Did not miss a single auto there. My guy is low HP. Meditation was a little bit slow there. A little bit slow. Probably had to use it a little bit earlier just to s try to live through my one. But, uh, you know, that's okay. He still doesn't have beads, and I do have my ult, so he, he needs to be careful here. I can corner him easily. In fact, I will. That is going to be a kill and a surrender. GG to Jota. I would message him, but obviously he's got the weird A in his name. And uh, I'll see you guys in game number two. Thanks for sticking around. Yo, what's up, boys? Welcome back to game number two. Welcome back. I'm playing New Wah. Obviously, there's Kronos open. There's Soul open. There's, uh, I mean, there's Medusa open. There's a lot of insane options. But uh, <clears throat> I just felt like playing New Wah. I don't know why I play. Well, okay. I do know why it's because I played her the other day. I was, I was playing, um, what was I playing? I was playing duel, but I don't know against who I, I was playing duel against somebody and they banned all of the magical ADCs. They banned Kronos, Oleron, Soul, and Freya. And I was like, okay, they clearly don't want to fight a mage ADC. So what did I do? Obviously I took out the new wall. What I consider to be a mage ADC, even though she's kind of not, but she is, you know, to me. Um, <clears throat> I play her like an ADC. I just think she's so fun to play as ADC because the root is really good. No way. Good luck. Thanks, my dude. <laughs> Lesson number one. Lesson number one to getting good at the game. Never say good luck back because then they'll beat you. Learn that the hard way. 
Every time I say good luck to my enemy, they beat the shit out of me. And it's not close, by the way. It's never close. I say good luck and they, they slap me into the ground and then curb stomp me. And it's not cool. So, I no longer say good luck to people. Unless I'm not against them. If, if they're, if, you know, if they're doing other things, I say good luck all the time. But like, you know. I think my good luck just holds too much power in this world. If I wish good luck to somebody, they always do good. And it makes me mad. Because they beat me every time. <laughs> but either way, it doesn't matter. Regar regardless of the fact that I think my luck is more powerful than my gameplay. Um, we got this matchup, Chalk vs. Nuwa. And I don't know much about this matchup. Obviously, I don't play Nuwa enough to know every matchup there is. But, what I do know, if I just play like a normal-ass Mage ADC, I should be okay. Um, wow, he's actually going to let me out-pressure him. Which I don't think is the correct call. Because he probably should just be able to outpressure me. <clears throat> but, you know. Maybe he's scared of my name or something. He does know who I am, so there is potential. And I know it's it sounds pretty shitty to say, but people do get intimidated because I'm known for duel and, you know, been GM and rank one and shit like that. So people just get intimidated by my name. And they don't play as aggressive or as well as they should. Um, you know, I know if you've watched the videos in the past and this isn't your first video. First off, if it is your first video, hello, what's up? And um, second, if it's not, then you'll know that people have messaged me before saying that they were nervous playing the game or that, you know, they were just not playing how they normally do because they were fighting me and they were starstruck or whatever. By the way, I'm not star like I'm, I'm a dude that sits granted right now not in my underwear but most of the time sit here in my underwear that plays video games for a living you know like it's not i'm not i'm not special <laughs> i am i'm very far from special all right i win this fight thanks mannequins that <laughs> was a close fight though that was a close fight I think he just waited a little bit too long to use his meditation. Which, you know, a lot of people do that. I, I do that too. It's hard to judge because the, the longer you wait with meditation, the more it heals you. There's a very fine line between waiting too long. You know? Oh, God, please. I think I can kill him here, actually. I have a full minion wave backing me up. He has no alt. Oh, that was close. That was close. All right. Send him back to base. Are you going to miss this XP? Oh, you are. All right. That that is a very um respectful back. Like like him he put respect on my name. Obviously, he should because if he didn't, I would kill him. But that was a good back. That was that was actually smart. There's some backs where you miss XP and you're like, ah, just not worth it. But like that back was actually. Sp I don't have ult, by the way. So if he ults the crap out of me, I might die. Who knows? I don't know what's going to happen. All I know is I want to do the red buff. And nobody is going to stop me. Get him, minions. Or or die on your on your transit over. <laughs> I guess that's that works, too. Uh, your blue should be up, right? God, I'm so short. I can't even look. Always watching. Uh -huh. Always lurking. Ouch. <clears throat> are you going to ult? You are, so I will ult. You'll run away. And I will do the blue anyways. Oh, let's go, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Super good three through the wall. I didn't know if I should try to get the three through the wall or if I should go for the 
the buff. And in my head, I figured, you know what? Worst thing that happens, I missed the three over the wall. And it takes me a second longer to do the buff. Either way, it's worth the risk of throwing the three over the wall. And we actually hit it and got the kill with it. Hell yeah, man. That's huge. <clears throat> That's actually huge. All right, now a breastplate of valor would be very, very good here. Obviously, as new wall, even even as auto attack new wall, you want to get a little bit of cooldown online if you can. But we'll go breastplate. Now, dude, I, I'm trying so hard not to troll. Like you don't understand. I really just wanted to go telekines, just just right off the bat. No breastplate, just straight into telekines. I really wanted to, but it's just, it's so greedy. And against Chalk, too, like, his one does so much damage. His itch of all now, so my attacks are going to be slower. Like, it's just not really worth it, waiting that long. Are you going to TP in? No, you're not. All right. I'm maxing my two, so I can try to get three minions. By the way. Okay. All right, there's his meditation. Uh, I don't have alt up, but I don't think I need it. Oh God, that hit. That hit. Uh, I want to see if I can make him not get the XP here, or if he does get the XP, he'll have to die for it. Very nice. I had really, really good tracking there. Shout out to Apex Legends. Shout out Apex Legends helping me with my tracking. Very good tracking there. Didn't miss a single auto and actually ended up getting the kill. Nice. Let's go grab that red buff now. And I do have breastplate, so I have 20% cooldown, which is great. My tummy is rumbling. What the heck? All right, let's slowly do this. I'm not going to use my three. I'd rather save it for him if he decides to fight me. Into the shadows. That doesn't kill. Well, oh, it leaves them at literally one HP. You're trolling, dude. Leaves them at literally one. Can my minions do this? I'm sure they can't. All right, I now have maxed out two, which means <coughs> I get three minions. Destroyed. Means my burst damage is incredible right now. There he is. Oh my god. Dude, I'm just slamming. My auto attacks are just slamming. Alright. <laughs> I love I love auto attack Nuwa. She's so much fun. Holy crap. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Thank you guys for watching game number two. I will see you guys in game number three. <laughs> <clears throat> Welcome back to game number three, my submissive boys. <laughs> I'm playing Anubis. I don't know why. I just felt like playing Anubis. I'm fighting a guy named Kevin. I, if that, if you actually got the name Kevin, nice name. Okay, no, he didn't. He didn't actually get the name Kevin. This is a little bit weird, I guess. He's got a little bit of a weird name. Uh, I'm actually going to do this and I'm going to go shell. Um, this could be a tough, this could be a tough game for sure. This could definitely be a tough game. That being said, it could also slam. I don't play Anubis much because anti heal is very good. Anti heal is super good in general. So, uh, I don't play Anubis the most anymore. Okay, actually dumpstered. 
actually dumpstered. You have to run away. There's no way you ever fight me here. He is running away. He might do his blue buff, which is fine. I'm going to just clear the wave with my one. And then I will do red buff. <clears throat> if I can. Uh, my cooldowns are kind of long. Jeez. That took a lot longer than I thought it would to get a red buff down. Holy crap. But it doesn't matter because we're leading, boys. We are leading. Let's go. A bit of a, a bit of a weird start. Definitely a bit of a weird start, but not bad. Weird, but not bad. I do wonder if I could kill him though, maybe, because he is slightly greedy. Okay, never mind. I'm just gonna ult him. Um, minions. Oh, no, dude, no. My shell ran out. My shell ran out the second that his last auto attack hit me. If it if it took that last auto, I would have won the game. Well, I mean, won the fight. I will still win the game, but hopefully at least. Who knows? He has beads. Come now, don't be shy. I guess I should not have gone for the alt there. Hey, hello. I mean, that was actually a lot of damage on him. Um, if I wrap him and I'm close enough to get my, oh, his, what, what is he doing? Oh, so close. So close. He wants to alt me, I guess. Thank you. Okay. Bit of a weird play there, for sure. He has no mana, and I do have mana. Uh, might die here. Might die. It didn't, but it could have. Okay, this game is a little bit, uh, a little bit more sensitive than I had originally thought. Okay, a little bit more sensitive than originally thought. Yeah, that's okay. I scared him. Alright, good clear. Really good clear, actually. Clear this. <clears throat> and then let's clear my blue. And we will have all three buffs. We will have all three buffs. And even though I lost the first blood, I'll be ahead in the game. Which is massive, by the way. Actually massive. And I want to go divine. I actually want to rush a divine. Because he, as Olron, has a health chalice. Which means he's going to be popping that bitch 24-7. He has Bancrofts. <clears throat> Never mind, it's Typhons, but it's lifesteal regardless. And he has <coughs> a heal in the form of his three. <coughs> he doesn't have beads though, so if I, if I land a rap, he dies 100%. Okay. 
Okay. I, I mean, I called it. He chased me by using his beads, so I knew that if I landed the rap, he was dead. In fact, he still doesn't have beads. He might have his alt up. I'm not sure. Loran alt is quite a long cooldown. Oh, he does. Okay, I'm dead. Okay. I'm just juking. I'm literally just juking. Get away from me. Bancroft, save me. Let's go. Let's go, Bancroft, dude. Let's go, Bancroft. Do, 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 do. Let's go, Bancrofts. All right. Now I'm going to corner him, and he's going to surrender the game. This is 100% facts. Okay. Or he beats. You don't win this fight. And he surrenders. I knew it, dude. I call... I play so much duel. I know the mental game down to a freaking T. I knew he was going to surrender. The second that I corner him and I kill him, I knew he was going to surrender. Man. I play this game a lot, huh? <laughs> Anyways. I hope you guys enjoyed game three. I will see you guys in game number four. What's up, boys? Welcome back to game numero cuatro. So, uh, four? Five? Are we on four or five? Uh, I played Nuwa, uh, Anubis. I played Oleron. Game number four. Okay, perfect. Just takes a little bit of recall, okay? And after a little bit of recall, I got it. I'm back. Don't worry. I'm back. Okay, so I'm fighting a Loki. Uh, I don't know what I was going to say. My brain turned off. I, I need another cup of coffee. I look, like I said, I, I didn't sleep very much and I had one cup of coffee. My brain just doesn't work. Just come me. Okay, look, come me some slack. Enjoy the gameplay. That's all I want to say. Okay, that's all I want to say. Just come me some slack. Enjoy the gameplay. Yeah, I don't miss. Okay, it doesn't matter if you're stealth or not stealth. I don't miss. Good try, doofus. That's my blue buff, by the way. Oh, okay, never mind. You can have it. I didn't want it anyways. Joke's on you. What did I want? Just uh, a slow and casual red buff. That took you a long time to do that blue. But I guess to be fair, you do have Warrior's Axe. So I don't really know what I was expecting. You're not going to do a red buff or you're not going to do a buff supersonic quick with Warrior's Axe Loki. Although, that being said, he doesn't have Boombas, so your late game is not going to be the hottest. Your late game is not going to be the hottest. I'm a little surprised he didn't try to kill me. I feel like most Lokis in that scenario would try to murder. Uh, am I deceased? Nope, he's deceased. Okay. I, dude, I should have died. I definitely should have died. Mannequins, the attack speed slow on mannequins actually saved my life. And I'm not kidding. <clears throat> Does it not slow attack speed anymore? Maybe it doesn't slow attack speed anymore. No, they do have their attack speed reduced. Uh, dude, I, I should have lost that fight. <clears throat> but with the new change to Freya and her ult being completely instant damage. Uh, I was going to say reduction, but it's not reduction. It's complete damage mitigation. 
where you would just become invincible. Um, you don't scare me. You, you just, you straight up, you just don't do enough damage to scare me right now. Unfortunately for you, I suppose. Where are you? Best friend. Hello, best friend. You still want to be my best friend? Hello, best friend. Okay, he didn't want to be. Anyways, he's out of there. I'm going to get my demonic. By demonic, obviously, I mean my lifesteal one. Wow, that was close. Thank God for complete instantaneous damage mitigation. That's ridiculous. I had 9 HP. Imagine being me. Literally, literally sitting there, 9 HP. That's so dumb. The fact that I'm able to do shit like that is so stupid. I, that, that, oh man, that almost makes me mad. <laughs> like, <coughs> I ulted with 9 HP. And lived. And not only did I live, but I got the kill, my guy. My guy. I got the kill. What the f Yo, Frey is dummy. He goes dummy. Not as dummy as some of the other mage ADCs, obviously, but I mean, pretty fucking dummy still. These aren't the wards you are looking for. Yo. Oh, over there. Alright. I mean his clear is not good. He's he's really gotta he's really gotta try his his best at clearing. Alright, we're chilling, we're chilling. Clearing wave again. I have alt, which means I'm pretty much immune to death. I'm not gonna stand at your tower line and wait. I'm just gonna go farm. <clears throat> That's weird that there was only one of those left. Where art thou? Wow, I actually... I actually could have sworn that I whooped him there. If you if you put a gun to my head and said, did you whoop him? I would have said yes. And then you would have shot me and I would have felt bad about myself for, you know, the millisecond that I'm actually still alive. Boom, pow, bop. Get his ult. Or his med, either one works, honestly. I figured he would have ulted instead of medding because medding has a longer cooldown, but. <clears throat> I guess it's worthless to him because if he if he keeps his ult, he still has kill potential on me. <clears throat> but not really anymore because I just I have life steal, I have defense, and I have my meditation still up. And he only is stacking defense. Like he, all, everything he has is defense right now. Warriors into runic into ancile, and yes, that is an ancile. It's the only thing he can build into. I suppose it could be a cat shield, but that would just be stupid. Hello. There's not much more disrespect you can do to a Loki than let them hit you and not react. It, it's almost, it is, the, it straight up is the most disrespectful thing you can do to a Loki. Which is why I did it. <laughs> this is my red buff. Get the fuck away from me. Boom, pow, bop, bada boom, bada pow. You have blue buff on? Don't. I don't know where he went. I don't know where he went. He's probably doing his blue. That's fine. I think my next uh my next item is either gonna be a 
Toxic Blade or a Demonic Grip? Because I'm going to need some pen. Toxic Blade's not for pen. Toxic Blade is just for the attack speed. But I can literally stand in all of your damage and not be scared of anything. I missed. Okay, there's his alt. Um, you know, I, I really can't do much here. I'm going to stand here. Um, I mean, he missed most of the wave, so <clears throat> it's a win. Not a huge one. Still a win. I'm going to run through tower and get ulted. All right. Take tower. I don't care about what he does. Surprise. He's stuck. He got stuck in the minions. <laughs> he got stuck in the minions. No, my guy. <laughs> oh no you poor poor soul i'm so sorry that happened to you i'm so sorry oh my gosh that's so funny though <laughs> just him trying to wiggle out of the minions and him not moving at all <laughs> oh no dude oh no hello lokester I'm pretty safe to just go do Bull Demon, probably. I don't think that he has the damage to out secure me. He actually did get one of those. There you go, he's backing. Alright, we grab Red Buff here and then we just go to Bull Demon. That's the game plan. Maybe I do not need to do Bull Demon. I do a ton of damage to him. I mean, I got Demonic so I could do damage, I guess. To be fair. We'll do our burst here. And then we'll wait a second. Actually, no, we don't have to wait. He's super far. We're fine to just damage it up. Hello. He's going for minions. Again, I don't think I care. I think this is like, he's he just went so tanky that there's nothing he can do to me. I can actually like sit here and let him punch me in the forehead all day. And it doesn't matter. Like I heal, I'm healing. Okay, hold on. That was kind of cringe because I missed seven autos in a row. But, uh, like, point stands. Him going full tank, Loki, is not gonna... It's not gonna catch any dubs. Not today. Not today. I will be honest, though. It feels damn good. To just sit here and not care about a Loki's damage for once in my life. Because, like, honestly, 99% of the time against a Loki, you're just sitting there scared that you're going to die. 
Not against this one, though. <laughs> oh you have been died to the tick damage let's go dude nice nice play all right but <clears throat> I was just going to do that until I died anyways. That was the entire goal because I just want to get Telekines online. You doing red buff? Should be. Not that it would help that much to be completely honest, but... Actually, instead of Telekines, I could just go Bancrofts and be, be there infinitely. Like, if I, if I pick up blue buff right here, instead of red... I could just stand on his tower line forever with, with Bancrofts. Because he has no anti you. I mean, he has Pestilence, but, like, what's 25% going to do? Basically nothing is the answer. That's insane. Oh, he's going Beatstick, though. Nice. Ah, uh, I didn't get the whoop off. I'm lucky. Oh, I just realized... All those waves before, they weren't even fire minions. Oh, hello. Oh, altered into tower or fountain. All right. I'm healing so much. It, dude, this is insane. This is actually insane. He can't do anything. I could have got Telekines, but I think Bancrofts was actually the better play here, believe it or not. Which is ridiculous to think that a fourth or fifth item Bancrofts is the best play to make, but it was. It was. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that game. I will see you guys in game number five. And thank you guys so much for sticking around. If you are so far, make sure to go and comment pineapple. Okay. See you guys in game five. <clears throat> Yo, what's up, boys? Game number five or six. I don't even know anymore. It's been an hour, but we're still going because I've been sitting in queues for a hot minute. All right, it's sadly again, but he's playing Kamazots and uh-oh, Cheerio, I know he's a fan, and I know he watched my video about the best assassin in Duel, and I know he's probably going to try to shit on me. Unfortunately for him, I also know one other thing. I'm the one who made the video. <clears throat> Therefore, I'm safe from any of my own... From any of my own recommendations. That's how it works, and if he kills me, then everyone report him, because he's not allowed to. <clears throat> uh, his level 3 is not better than mine perhaps maybe oh no it definitely is he's got warrior's axe okay if he misses an ability we kill him okay he didn't miss his one but he didn't catch it either okay he missed his 3 or his 2 I mean <laughs> well he was dead so i guess he he decided to use his time while dying to spam laugh rather than uh rather than juke i guess to be fair it is better to just die there because then you can at least get to a buff quicker you can at least get to your blue buff quicker and lose less xp overall so in a way that was the right play Actually, not even in a way. Like, just straight up, it was the right play to die faster. <clears throat> Maybe I should have had the foresight to understand what was happening in front of my eyes and not kill him that quickly. That would have been... That would have been five head. All right. All right. 
I'll auto these guys twice. They'll both die. Then I'll do the big one. I'm so far ahead, it's ridiculous. It is level 5, though. Um, I don't know if I should be scared here or not. I feel like I should be. But I'm not exactly sure why I should be. I just feel like I should be. <clears throat> hey, baby. Can you boil some water for me? Huh? Oh, thank you, baby. Okay, he ulted. Now he runs away. He turns to think he can kill me, and I kill him. Unless I die. Cringe! Oh, please live. Just live, just live, just live, please. He's gonna he's gonna be around the corner. He's gonna be around the corner. Terrified. <laughs> he thought he could hide. You can't hide from inevitability, my dude. Oh, he paused. <laughs> Hey man, you know, sometimes you take those L's where you don't expect to take those L's and you just got to pause and think and you got to do this. You got to do one of these. And then get your head back in the game. Sometimes that's just what has to happen. I understand. Trust me. I understand. You do the, you do the double face palm. You rub your forehead, rub your temples. You're, you're getting a migraine. Just off the plays that you don't expect to happen and then you just got to get back in the game i understand it trust me i do maybe more maybe maybe even more than you do actually as many autos as i've hit in this game i've missed twice as much and that's a fact you know what they you know what you know what uh bruce lee said was it Bruce Lee? I don't know if it was Bruce Lee or not. But either way, what oh, I think Bruce Lee, he said the master has failed more times than the beginner has tried. There you go. That basically just means I suck, by the way. Um, he's going Blackthorn, but he's a little bit, a little bit slow with it. That's my blue. Well, I, uh, I think it's safe to say that I've killed not only him four times, but also his pride just a bit because he just stood there while I murdered him. Um, I think now's a good time. To just cut to the next game. So thanks for watching this one. I appreciate it. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next game. Because I don't think this one's going to last very long. Welcome back boys to game number. I don't even know at this point. Like 6, 7, 8, 24. I've been recording for 17 hours. This is game number 644. Dude, I don't know. It doesn't matter because we're just gaming. All we're doing is we're tryharding, we're gaming, we're pogging. Not Emphasis now, on pogging. And I'm going to go tank Bastet, which is the most disgusting thing in the game at the moment. Period. Uh, in duel, I permaban Bastet, not because I think she's the best assassin in duel. Uh, even though currently she might be. But she is getting nerfed by 20% of her damage on her two. Uh, <clears throat> in... Five days when the new patch comes out. Season 9 comes out in five days. He gets nerfed quite a bit then. He has Boombas. So actually, he probably has better buff secure than I... You know, look, you get red buff. How about that? You get red, I'll get blue. Deal? We have a deal. I would like it if you would talk to me. Probably going to jump over the wall at some point. Oh, he's just standing there. Being a creeper. Just standing there being a creep, dude. 
It's actually so funny. Just standing there creeping. <laughs> oh, dude. Funny stuff. Hello. Young one. Young one who does not do enough damage to spook me. I wonder if I can do his blue buff now. I really want his blue. Like, really badly. Damn it, dude. I'll never get it. I'll never get it. Phone is going off. Oh, it's an alarm. Shit, dicks. I have an alarm going off. Okay. I could have gotten that kill, by the way, but I had to I had to turn my alarm off. That shit is mad annoying. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Let's go get a blue buff cuz I really want blue buff over red buff. Like red buff doesn't even matter to me. I don't care about damage. I'm fighting using tin, right? Like I'm most of the time going to out damage him. Unless something catastrophic happens in my life, which, yeah, you know, who knows, right? Yes, thank you. Most of the time I'm going to outdamage him, but, um, yeah. Let's see. He does have meditation, not beads. Hmm. Is such better buff secure because of the Boombas. One HP for real. Fine. Oh, I hit him with it. I did hit him with it. But he was still CC immune from his ult. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Should have muted. My bad. Um, yeah, he's still got his jump. All right. That was good. That was good. I am actually ahead in gold. Even though he got two buffs. Which is surprising. I want to know how much XP I am behind. Because I would assume I'm behind in XP. Just based off the fact that he got the two buffs. But let's find out. I hit level 8. He is missing some XP here. He hit level 8 off 3 minions. I think we're actually exactly even then. Me and him are actually exactly even. He got a Kronos Pendant first item. That is a bit odd. Don't see that often. Okay. If I ult, he more than likely just like, eh, whatever. I don't care too much. I spy with my little eye. Something else Probably gonna jump over the wall here. I have really good damage on him. He has to be careful. Like tr going for these buffs still. He still has to be careful here. I should not have beat that. No. Yeah, I should not have beat that. That was stupid. That was big dumb. Alright. 
right, he jumped away, which means I get the red buff. I actually will pick it up this time. The longer I can keep him from backing, the better it is for me. Because he's having a really hard time keeping up. Just in terms of farm. Only because of the fact that I'm bassed at basically and I can jump over walls and shit, but... I mean, he can too, but only buff walls. Because those are the only walls that are small enough for uh, Zington and Duel. Um, now, I could go Runic Shield here and ruin his day. Because he's a Guardian. And that's just what happens if, a, if someone goes double defense against you. You lose the game as a Guardian. Oh, man. <laughs> nice. Huge first blood, and he's going to miss the XP for that entire wave, which is massive for me. Which is massive for me. And uh, I'm going to go Runic here, and that should pretty much solidify this win. Unless something just absolutely horrendous happens which it shouldn't but <clears throat> no that should win the game for me right there i'm uh i'm now too tanky for him to kill and i still do enough damage for him to be scared of me basically just because i'm basket yeah he keeps jumping my two which is stuck but yeah his one did not very much damage to me I'll kill all that. Hit you with that. Nope. Fine. Oh, I really thought that could hit in that range. Damn. All right. Not enough to kill there, but like I'm still extremely healthy and he's having a rough time. I would love to get this blue buff because my mana is actually, even with Blackthorn, my mana is still slightly an issue. So I'm going to pick up the blue. Throw a cat over there. Maybe it hits him. Uh, didn't, but it was close. Dude, what am I healing so much from? I have incredible life steal, uh, incredible ability life steal versus him and versus minions. Oh, oh, that's fine. You do not scare me at all. That should have hit. But yeah, no, I'm definitely down to just like sit here and punch you in the forehead a lot you i do too much damage to you there's no way you ever win this fight i do so much damage and you do none jumped it that's fine cool with that i guess he thinks he can kill me because i have no cc immunity on my alt but i still do have beads <clears throat> just because I've been using my alt as my CC immune for your alt does not mean that I have no beads. Pick this up. Uh, I really want to go... <clears throat> uh, what's my next item? I want to go Soul Eater. Oh, I should not have tooed that. All right. I'll sign your forehead. Just yeah, I did. I did almost a hundred damage to myself with his thorns there. 
Um, I want to go Soul Eater. And then I also want to go Beat Stick. All right, cool. I had so much gold. Holy shit. I just bought a full... Wait, did I have 3k gold? That's ridiculous. Did I just bought a full Soul Eater and a Tier 1 Beat Stick. I had 3k gold, didn't I? Or like at least 2850. Or no, I, I, how much is it? Soul Eater is 2,100 gold. Tier 1 Yoans is 650. So I had at least, yeah, at least 2,750 gold. That's ridiculous. Why did I do that? <laughs> Boom! I do want to be in range when my minions die because you do get Soul Eater stacks when your own minions die. Alright. He didn't even jump back. I am sitting here at pretty much full HP this entire game. And this Soul Eater is only going to help. Like I said, I do want to stand near my wave while they die, so... I'm getting that those extra Soul Eater stacks. Alright. There you go. It's kind of nuts that the most competitive game I've had all day is against a Zington. That's kind of bonkers. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to go back now because I can go get my beat stick. This could and I am one buff away from having a finished Soul Eater. And that I'll do that right now. Just on this blue. I am going to keep picking up blue buffs. I just think like having that much mana is so important for me. Get him, cat. Get him, pussy cat. Oh, I can't. I can't. All right, let's see how much my two heals me. The Soul Eater here. Holy Jesus. I healed like 400 HP. Man, that heals me for so much. Actually, so much. I'm healing a crazy amount. <clears throat> he is going divine, though. How much does this heal me for? Oh my god! Wait, that healed me for like 800, dude. What in the fuck? Dude, my one healed me for so much. Oh my god. Like, even on just the buff, I went from 1100 HP to 1400 HP with my one. That's crazy. And you know, next patch, you can get the, uh, you can get the Jotuns that gives you ability lifesteal if you're low HP. Holy shit. The amount of healing this god's gonna have. Look at this, look at this. 1700 to 2200. Ridiculous. Okay.
I'm okay with this. I'm dead. Damn. I took 2,200 damage from the Phoenix. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so dumb. Alright, how much cooldown do I have? I have 20%. So I could go Jotun's here, actually. Cap out cooldown. Or I could not and just get blue buffs and red pots for my cooldown. Which I actually think I want to do. So that, yeah, that's my that's my game plan. I'll just get blue buff and uh and red pot for my cooldown reduction. Blackthorn right now giving me 10%. Soul Leader giving me 10%. Blue buff will give me 10%. And then, yeah. And then once I get my 500 pot, that'll be the last 10% I need. Perfect. I do wonder if I can do bold demon. Because the secure is very good, actually. My damage is really good, but the secure is nice. But it did take him a minute to get that wave cleared, so... I think we're safe. Never seen a fan get so aggressive. All right. Hello. How are you? Running away. Understandable. It's gonna let me do it. That's probably the best play, though, to be honest. I always say don't die for Phoenix. Well played, well played. Dude, my damage is so incredible. Holy shit. And then whenever a minion wave spawns, I just press one on it and I'm full HP. Look at this. I have 1300 HP right now. Well, as long as he doesn't divine me, I guess. I have 1300. Boom, 1800. So 500 HP heal. Oh, I didn't hit him. Cringe. Oh, he died. What'd he die to? Oh, he died to my warrior's axe proc. My crusher? My crusher procced on him, which procced my warrior's axe, which killed him. That's insane. But yeah, that's 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 GG, man. Hey. Shout out to you though, my guy. Shout out to you. A Zing 10 game being the most competitive game all day. I'm impressed. Truly. Really. Um But I hope you guys enjoy this video if you did make sure to like comment and subscribe and um yeah make sure to if you get this far go down and type pineapple or no no no, because earlier in this in the, earlier in the video i said type pineapple now if you get all the way to the end i want you to type pineapples are my favorite daddy i want you to type that okay if you don't then i'll know you're a fake fan anyways Love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, guys, peace.